good job what's going on this corner sports night do not forget to subscribe like share and comment Nick Saban won't quit he won't quit still has a problem with NIL still has a problem with it kind of tired of Nick Saban will he just retire go in the booth talk football four years ago you had no problem with college football none you have no problem with college football because you had all the power all the power now in 2024 NIL ran you up out of there and now you say football college football is not what we're witnessing yes we are College football is still in a good place. The top teams or the brand name teams are still doing well. It's just that players are getting paid. Look, if you want to make some kind of changes, you need to change how coaches do business too. You can't keep blaming everything on the product. You can't keep kicking the product, which are the players, back in. I have no problem what's going on with college football. None. It's the entertainment business. But yeah, I don't, when you go somewhere, sit down, relax, play golf. Now, I know you're the greatest college football coach ever, but a lot of older coaches have problems with this. It's like a lot of older people have problems on a job. They can't adapt. They can't adjust. They become that old dinosaur on the job. What Nick Saban is doing is trying to get power back to coaches. Where coaches run everything. Where coaches have the final say on everything. Where players don't have no power and they're not getting broke off. But college football is never going to go back to how it was where the product makes peanuts and the coaches and the networks make billions and billions of dollars off the product. So Nick Saban, let's go relax somewhere. Go talk football on ESPN or Fox. It's never going back to how it used to be. Nick Saban wants some kind of structure a payroll. How do you have a payroll for college athletes? Like they can't control their name, their image, their likeness. They can't leverage that to companies. And if there's a contract with the school, how much money are the players going to be making? Is it going to be a criteria for stars, for bench warmers, for second teamers? It never worked, Nick Saban. Never. Nick Saban also don't want players to be able to move around as they please. Why not? Coaches do it. Most people will tell you when they watch a college football game, they watch for the players. They care about who's coaching. They want to be entertained. Players, they entertain you. Not the coaches. Now, in other news, former Alcorn State head coach Brad McNair will be the assistant coach at Southern University. He only going to be there one year before he gets another head coaching job. He should be the coach at Texas Southern, but he got screwed over. Brad McNair spent eight years at Alcorn State, 48 and 33 record, bunch of swag championships, one of the better coaches at HBC. No, one of the best coaches in all of college football. He got a raw deal. He should be Texas Southern's head coach. But they end up hiring Chris Dishman. But he's only going to be at Southern for one year. Believe that. Now, the move to Southern is not official, but that's what I've been reading on all these blogs.